So, welcome again to Geeks 101. I'm John. And I'm Nick. <laughs> no, you're hi, I'm Nick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hi, I'm Nick. <laughs> Okay. Uh, that would be funny for many people. <laughs> I don't know. It is many. funny when when we upload the making of. It's very funny. Okay. So hi, I'm Nick. <laughs> I am John. <laughs> <clears throat> so we hope you're all good. And today we're going to talk about the Razer Black Widow Expert. It's a mechanical keyboard, <clears throat> and I think Nick has a lot. To talk about on this keyboard. No, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> so he does. Okay. He hasn't made use of it, I guess. Oh, okay. okay. I had another. Thing. Anyway. Yeah. Anyway. The, the main difference between a mechanical keyboard and a normal keyboard is that beneath every key in a mechanical keyboard there's a switch. And then that's a difference with the normal keyboard that has a membrane. So in the mechanical keyboard, you need much less force to press on a key in order to work anyway. Yeah, and it won't change no matter how much time passes, Kurt. You know, in older keyboards, I had a lot of Logitech and Microsoft ones with the membrane technology and as the time you know passed I would have to press a lot harder for a key you know to just uh, work and type the thing I wanted and actually we're uh, doing this video basically because we got a lot of emails asking you know what's that sound when you typing something when you make your videos and it sounds like a typewriter did you have any complaints about from neighbors, but <laughs> no, sound. no, I don't okay. think so. But it's very loud, but uh, it can be an intriguing sound anyway. Well, it's addicting, actually. It's addicting, yes. <laughs> Typing in that thing, it brings up memories, though. Yeah, it does. A different time, you remember? Yeah, like when, Amiga, we, when we were young. Oh yeah, <laughs> well, yeah. I remember. We're from Amiga, Amstrad, yeah. anyway, Atari. Oh, okay, Atari. <laughs> That's yeah. a good memory. Um, well, I remember when we were... <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna cry now. <laughs> no, no, no. I remember when we were still in our uh, school and we had these really old IBM PCs that I still love. They mm -hmm. were running Windows 3.1. 3.1. 3.1, yeah. And we actually learned on those things. <laughs> Even Microsoft Word and Excel and stuff like that, we learned on that thing. Which so that sound is ringing. Uh, yeah, they had very... mechanical keyboards and mm -hmm. they were there for like a million years before us. Like, you know, one of them even had a T Rex footstep on it. <laughs> you know, like, and anyway. I remember eating over them and just, you know, these keyboards falling down and stuff like that. You just took the uh, keycap and just. Okay, put it back, back in, back in. Yes, <laughs> and, and it still worked, yes. yeah, it just didn't matter. Okay. Some unknown people brought it to me when I had my birthday. <laughs> I don't know, <laughs> I don't know for that. It's one of the but best anyway. presents. And <laughs> do you want to kiss me right now? <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> it's really hard, come on. <laughs> um, <laughs> Well, anyway, <laughs> so what about this particular keyboard anyway? The this Razor particular keyboard, keyboard Black Widow. The first thing that you know hit me was the weight. Because it's light, light. No, weight. it's really heavy. heavy weight? Yeah. It's that like it's really robust anyway. Yeah, it's like one point five kilograms mm -hmm. and when you just put it on your desk it stays there. Like <laughs> it won't buzz. Okay. <laughs> like a paperweight. <laughs> you can put yeah, it's really important because you know all things. Yeah, when you type stuff and you know, can be used like a weapon. <laughs> Actually, pretty easy. You know, okay, if you have that in a baseball bat, what well, would you use? Well, that would win, you know, because okay. underneath it, it has ABS plastic. It's uh, the plastic that uh, the crash dummies are made of. I'm serious <laughs> <Okay>. about this. <laughs> so <laughs> if you you know just. Yeah. <laughs> Hit it hard okay. on a head or something. So it can be used like a weapon yeah. too. Okay, make a note on that. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 
So uh, actually, um, the sound is pretty distinctive, and if you you know read reviews and stuff like that from uh, you know online sources or you know read the booklet or anything like that from the razor that's you know in there, uh, you will see that our brain uh, actually makes uh, a connection with the sound. So when we hear the clicking sound, we're certain that what we just clicked just typed in without checking on your monitor so that's really important you don't have you know to check yeah. all the time if what you're typing is uh appearing on your monitor so that's pretty good thing okay so the sun may be a little frustrating for some but it's a good thing hmm? i'm drinking on camera <laughs> <laughs> don't drink on camera anyway Mm -hmm. So what about the macro keys? Well, it has a, a function key and a macro key, and you can so you can uh, okay pretty much assign to any key whatever command you want. Or, uh, well, yeah, you can assign any key uh, to do whatever you want, and you can do it on the fly, which is important instead of going into uh, the software uh, so that Razor gives. If you don't want to, you know, go in a software uh, GUI and start doing stuff and, you know, try to learn how it's done, uh, you just need to press the function key and the macro key, mm -hmm. and it will go into a recording mode. And when that happens, you can uh, press, uh, like, I think a lot of keys. <laughs> That's a lot of keys. And it will record that, and you can assign it to one macro key. And when you do that, you can just press that macro key, and it will do exactly what you okay. recorded. That's good for gaming. Yeah, yes, for gaming for stuff. Apartment. Also, yeah. there is a game mode. Game with, mode. Yeah, with the function keys. When you press the function key and the gaming mode key, mm -hmm. it will go into gaming mode, which means. Uh, I think the Windows button won't work, so when you're playing something, you know, a game. Okay, don't press it by accidentally. Yeah, because it happens a lot and, you know, it's kind of a ball buster. <laughs> <laughs> I heard from many people that the performance in FPS games improved using that keyboard. Well, yeah, because it has like a thousand hertz, so that means it has a... Very good response time. Yeah, it's like two milliseconds or something. Milliseconds. Even It can even touch one millisecond. In some cases, which is really so good. So you can kill many people with that. <laughs> in an FPS game, I mean. Yeah, yeah. Uh, a lot of reference to baseball bat. So. <laughs> Forget about it. Anyway. Okay, oh, don't forget about that. <laughs> um, what else about that keyboard? Hmm. Well, the keycaps, they're uh, lasered off. So they have this uh, plastic layer which is good and grippy, you know, when you touch it, it's not, you know, slippery or stuff like that. And it's lasered off, which means, you know, that it won't uh, wear off mm -hmm. like a paint or something. It, it will stay there. It does get dirty though, but, you know, with a bit... You have to clean it. Yeah. And you have to clean it a bit because it's glossy. So mm -hmm. okay, there so is, you know, it even a dirt. little dust, yeah, you can see that. Well, the expert that I have doesn't have any backlight features, so the but only what's, uh, the price for the ultimate keyboard. The it's ultimate about keyboard, I think it's forty dollars. It's about forty dollars higher. The mm -hmm. expert, and you lose the okay, the backlight feature, uh, the headphone. Uh, yeah, the headphone and the mic. microphone. Yeah, and yes. a USB it has a USB, a USB. plug too. <laughs> Well, so the expert doesn't have uh, a microphone uh, plug, uh, it's a 3.5 jack. It doesn't have the uh, headphone jack and it, it lacks the USB port. Okay, so if you want to pay $40 more, you can yes. buy those features anyway. Yeah, uh, it's I think $70 for the expert that lacks those. And 120, 120, 112, I think, 112 mm -hmm. for the ultimate. Mm -hmm. We'll have okay. links below from Amazon, and you can buy it off there. It's a pretty decent price because here in Greece it's a bit more expensive. I think the one 
you got was like yes, 80, euros, 80 euros, which is uh, like 90 bucks. So it's a lot more expensive actually. <laughs> it's but a very good keyboard for that price, I think. Well, it's a very good keyboard. And, and it's a keyboard that you buy one time and you hold for very long time. Yeah, because like it has a guarantee for 50 million strokes for each button. <laughs> oh, and uh, if you want to use the software to make, uh, you know, any macro keys, you can uh, assign a macro to any key, like you can, <laughs> even the letters or the space button or enter or anything like that can do. Okay, this. So you can make your own keyboard. Yeah, you can make your own keyboard. <laughs> that's what. Don't do it for encryption. <laughs> <laughs> encryption, like <laughs> first button will be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <laughs> <laughs> um, Okay, uh, I think it's a really good, you know, buy because uh, it's what Nick said. You will just keep it for a lifetime, <laughs> even if it's just the expert. Oh, it does have some backlight. The logo. Oh, the little yeah, Razer logo. It's the Razer logo, which has, I think, um, four modes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you're serious. Four <laughs> they include the four backlight. modes for that. Yeah, and it's only the logo which is off. <laughs> okay. Uh, uh, low. <laughs> yes. It's on and it's low, medium, high. Oh, five modes if you include include the off mode. Mm -hmm. And the fifth mode is uh, blinking. But no, it's like glowing for a little bit and then going back off and then again. Something like that. Yeah, so it's giving it for personalization. And <laughs> well, yeah. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> it's a pretty. Okay, that's a bit weird. weird. Anyway, I have five modes for a logo. Anyway, it's a bit well, weird. Yeah. No? <laughs> you like it? Well, I don't really care. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but <laughs> okay, but you mentioned it, dude. I mentioned it because I said it has no backlight, so you know, it has some backlight on one special place. Okay. Low special place. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, um, it's really addicting when you type on that thing. I really mean it because you know you're typing something uh, on any other computer, or you know you want to do something, and you're thinking, no, I'm not using my razor. This is you know like <laughs> really bad. <laughs> I have to use my razor. Um, yeah. So if you use that keyboard. You won't do any any other keyboard. You no, won't use any other keyboard. I, I don't want to use any other keyboard. Are well, you sure? I like my uh, laptop's keyboard too. It's an Asus. It's pretty decent, and I like the uh, flat keyboard keyboards of the laptops. Anyway, the mechanical keyboards is very special about the way that uh, they are built, and uh, if you use a mechanical keyboard, I believe that you are not. Going back to a membrane keyboard ever, ever again, ever. actually. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's pretty good for gaming, but um, if you're annoyed by sound, then don't buy this keyboard because the sound, you know, I find it really cool and addicting, and I always like the typewriter sound. It's uh, a lot lower than that. Uh, it's not that, you know, loud. But it does click, um, and we will demonstrate it for you just for a bit. Mm -hmm. um, but it's if you're annoyed by sounds, or you know you're in a place that people are sleeping beside and stuff like that, uh, don't don't buy this because they're probably um, the sleeping house or of killing you <laughs> once or twice a day. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, and yeah, like a band and. You know, you can an angle, an angle. yeah, an angle, but you can make it even higher. Uh, it has some uh, small switches from uh, the two sides, and it does go a lot higher. So Ergonomic, like a, yes, yes, but it's not like a common keyboard that has uh, either flat or no, no, uh, it's not like that. It does have an angle mm -hmm. by default because uh, it's, it's adjustable anyway. It is adjustable at with some point anyway. Well, so if if you see the keyboard, you can see that all the layers of the buttons, each row actually, it's um, in a, a different uh, height. Mm -hmm. So even if you have it on the lowest angle or in the higher angle, because it has only mm -hmm. two steps 
of angle mm -hmm. um, You can see that uh, it doesn't annoy you because it's not like all the buttons will go like this. They will go like this. They're always, you know, uh, on a different height. Well, actually, I'm gonna bring it to you. <laughs> Wait. Nobody so hears me. this is the keyboard, uh, and you can see that it does have a built-in angle. I think. Okay. The sound when you click on this thing is like this. Well, when you actually type, it's something like this. Which is really addicting. Hmm. Yeah, stop now, man. No, I just like it. Okay, stop it. Okay, they hear you. No, they didn't hear me. Stop yeah. it, man. No, wait. Stop <laughs> no. it, man. I have to type. Oh my god. It's a thing. No. Away from you. No. <laughs> no. Here, come, come. Take him. No. Take him. No. Oh. I didn't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> I need my keyboard. It's mine. My own. My precious. <laughs> Come Please, on. Please, doctor, the injection. Please. <laughs> the, the tranquilizer. The tranquilizer gun. No. For the elephants, yes. <laughs> that one. <laughs> no. Okay. One time every week. That can go on, I tell you. I can go on. Anyway, that's all for the mechanical keyboard. I hope okay. you enjoy it. Okay, hope you enjoyed. If you want to buy this keyboard, please click on the link on the Amazon link. Okay. Thank you very much for watching.